Center of gravity of a body is the point at which the weight of the body acts. Yes, this is true. This is correct. Okay, center of mass of coincides with the center of gravity of the Earth is assumed to have an infinitely large radius. So, okay, when if the Earth is having infinitely large radius, there would be some um, acceleration due to gravity. And now, any body at the top of Earth, okay, so it is having some different g here and some different g here okay so if it is because it's different so therefore uh, it it uh, this doesn't you know qualifies the right answer to evaluate the gravitation field intensity to any point any body at an external point the entire mass of the body can be considered to be at this and considered center of gravity so for sphere it is true the acceleration due to gravity will be gm by r square from its center where r is greater than r r but for a uniform rod of mass m it's going to be gm by a l plus a this, this is l and this is a so now this is again not uh, supporting this theory should be considered so this is also wrong radius of gyration of any body rotating about in its axis is the length of the perpendicular drop from the center of gravity of the body to the axis now that is not correct why because if you see this is the let us say sphere it is rotating so therefore when it is rotating about its center of mass its moment of inertia is 2 by 5 m r square this is solid solid sphere this should be equal to m k square so gone gone so k is the radius of gyration which is root 2 by 5 into r now if we drop from the center of gravity a perpendicular to the axis is actually zero the length is zero so therefore fourth will not be the answer okay so ideally only first answer i feel it is 